we had, it was the usual type of thing. We had 50, 50 something judges. We tasted a few thousand wines. And at the very end, we voted for the best wine of the entire judging. I was shocked and everyone else was shocked at that time when they told us what it was that we voted for. The best wine out of those thousands of wines that we had tasted over a three-day period turned out to be a Lodi Syrah selling for about $5.99. Lodi is so fortunate to have Randy advocating and speaking on its behalf. His writing and his photography has brought national attention to the Lodi wine scene and Lodi as a tourism destination. Bottom line, Randy brings huge credibility to Lodi. You know, I mean, Lodi basically wasn't even on the map not that long ago. And so now he has gotten people to read about Lodi and to come to Lodi. You see, when I was working my way through college, I sort of took an academic sort of approach to my profession, which is waiting on tables at that time, and I was very interested in wine. So I read a lot of magazines and I collected wines, I collected corks, I collected labels. I did everything a wine geek, wine lover does. So I, I chose a career and it happened to be wine. So I became a sommelier, because I didn't want to just wait on tables all my life. I wanted to work with what I thought was the best part of the business. You know, Randy does a phenomenal job with telling the Lodi story in a really beautifully and uh, engaging way. He takes the stories of our vineyards and our cellars, our winemakers and our families, and really captures them in, in prose that goes into publications and online and really gives folks the, the behind the scenes picture of what's happening. You know, Randy loves Lodi, and he loves Lodi wine, and, and here's, he's friends with all of us in the industry. He'll come out, you can call him up, say, are you going to do a bottling? And he'll be right there to start taking pictures. He's pushed us vintners in the area to do more and to look beyond our, our neighbors and beyond Lodi to see how we can be better winemakers and how we can be better at telling the story of Lodi. And he is telling everybody the story. He has the right connections. He is able to reach people we can never reach without him. He invites the wine writers for personal tours of Lodi and lets us in on it so that we can get our wines in front of these wine writers in like the secret of our own homes. So he has been unlocking the door for and bringing people in that would never have thought to come to Lodi if it wasn't for Randy. His voice is heard, his message has weight. I mean Lodi is real, I think. I think that's what's impressive about Lodi. Um, when you meet people who own vineyards and make wine and have been come from families that have been here for over a hundred years, you know, in some cases going back to the 1860s or 1870s and 1880s, uh, um, that's really, really impressive. We couldn't be more proud or more excited to have Randy be our 2014 Tourism Advocate of the Year. Congratulations, Randy.